What is up everybody? Welcome back to the episode 7 of the Pokemon Sapphire version randomized Nuzlocke challenge and in the last episode we did not really progress much other than just encounters but today I did promise you guys to fight with the gym leader in this episode and give the letter to Steven and go to sleep out for more encounter so if you guys are hyped and if you guys like the let's play so far do support with the thumbs up and the subscribe button down below for now let's go on and have a quick team party recap as you can see it I've trained all till level 15 and all of them are ready to go I believe they are starting off with Raiden the allocate who is level 15 now Careful nature, who has quick attack, leer and thunder punch. He sadly didn't learn anything despite all that. Next up we have Bling, the Chimeko, who is also level 15, serious nature. He has learned Rap, Growl, Astonish and finally he learns Confusion. Finally he has a stab move for him. Next up we have Avenger the Marowak who is a modest nature level 15 who is still has the same 4 set move since episode 1 Growl, Tail Whip, Bone Club and Headbutt Next up we have Man Ray the Mantine Impish nature level 15 who has Tackle, Bubble, Supersonic and a new move Bubble Beam Very neat as well during the grinding And last but not least we have Barry no longer the Chikorita but Bayleaf who is a bashful nature who got level up I train him to be level 16 just one level above because he can be uh, bay leaf I'm sorry he may not be shown on the video but I just fast forwarded in the training tackle poison powder cut and razor leaf he has pretty decent move now and he's ready to go bury the bay leaf and also I would like to show you guys as well that I train all of my backup Pokemon as well. As you can see, Nancy Seeking level 15, Houdini Jossie 15, Lizzie the Nuzleaf who is level 15 as well, and Nova the Seedra level 15 as well. Now, my thing is, I'm not sure whether should we go and uh, handle the Steven uh, let the thingy first and then we go fight with the gym or should we fight with the gym and then go handle the Steven issue um, for me I think I feel like probably we should go and handle Steven thing first I, I, I find that pretty dry and boring a little bit a little bit I mean okay it's actually pretty fun for us to walk around I guess but I'm not gonna use HM Flash, really, really. To be honest, I'm not gonna use HM Flash for for just to find Steven and that's it. I'm not. I'm not really planning to use it. So I'm just gonna use my knowledge of how many times I played Gen 3 for me to know this place. And we have a gold in here. Thunder punch him real quick. Hey, all right. This is for the bike to go up. And we can go down here. Oh. What? Oh my. What? Are you kidding me? There's a. There's a Rayquaza here. Just gonna run. I mean, he didn't appear as our first encounter. We have. We have Golem instead. But the King Rayquaza here. <laughs> wow, I I'm sorry. I'm just a little bit stumped and shocked. I am stumped and shocked. So yes, I know there's a Pokeball here, and it's just a paralyzed heal, pointless, useless. Okay, it's not really pointless, right? I I'm kidding. I need it. Okay. Oh no, Shupet. Or Shapet or Shupet. Wait. 
let's let us go all the way and this is where like I think this one's a rock smash area yep up here here right it's got the bar um well I'm just really shocked that there's Rayquaza in this cave and it's like chilling um I think there's like a everstone that we could take I'm not sure is it really everstone here it's a rabuta berry the hell's a rabuta berry what is rabuta berry Yep, he's just grow rabutas. Oh no, can we can we check it out? How does it look like? Oh my god! Look at the berry! Like he has mohawks everywhere. Damn! It's a rare variety that is overgrown with hair, and it is quite bitter. Wow! I mean, really, that mohawk looks pretty. Pretty amazing on the berry, if you ask me. <laughs> Alright. Let's move along. I I'm just too shocked about the Rayquaza encounter. It was really, really shocking, if you ask me. I really never expected that all of a sudden. So, here we are. We have now made it out without using Flash. Um, nope. No more. No more. Cloister. Thank you. All right. Really, how many how many times do we have to face these guys, huh? There you go. So let us go and meet Steven and puzzle letter that he needs. Right. That device you have there, it's a Pokémon. When trainers, they have spoken F's battle. Uh, that has Pokenev's battle, right. He keeps a record of how things went, I think. Oh, pardon me. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me. And yep, here you go, man. I even encounter a legend, bruh. I encounter a legend just to give you a letter. Alright, thank you. Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. Oh, yep, yep. I just, um, nah, you know, Rick, Rick was just nothing, you know. We, we ran away. <laughs> Let me see if I can. I'll give you this tea. Eh? My favorite move, stewing. Alright. <laughs> but is it really stewing, though? Is it really stewing? Do we check it out? TM47 is Dizzy Punch. I think this one can be teached to Elicate, I think. Oh, it's not able. Alright. Probably because it's still wing by right. Nope, nope. Run away, ignore you. Alright, so letter to Steven is done. Just gonna heal up real quick and now it's time for us to take a battle for our knuckle badge if I'm not mistaken is that what they call in the, the badge for this I think so I think that's what it's called let us save real quick all right Let's go. I accidentally pressed without even checking who's starting. I think it's Raiden who's first. Alright. I'm Brawly, your first gym leader. I've been turned in the rough waves of these parts and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanna challenge me? Let me see what you made of. Alright. Look man, I just want the badge and go man. Dude. Operator Cristiano Ronaldo? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright. And you send out a... Ooh, level 17 Electric. Um, 
Alright, I can quick attack. And... I got static instead of him? Really? Oh my god, that crit. Alright. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Pinch Avenger. And hit by him. Thank you. We didn't learn light screen. Okay. Pre that's pretty surprising for Raiden to learn light screen. A Puchiena. Right. 18, wow. Pretty high level. Thank you. A very easy gym battle. I, I was afraid there might be something more to that, but a Puchiena level 18, Avenger could take it all day. Whoa, wow. You made a much bigger splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. Hey. I mean, in fact, our level isn't that high because his two Pokemon were 17 and 18. And all of our highest is 16 and the rest are 15. So we are rather below rather than on par. But I'm glad that we managed to go through it easily. Other than Raiden almost died. The Knuckle Badge make all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in trade. Obey without question. To be able to use HM moves flash outside of the battle. No oh man, I don't need I don't need it. TMO8, if I'm not mistaken, is bulk up. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. But what is the TMO8 we get? Aroma Therapy. We get aroma therapy. Alright. Can anyone learn? Nope. Nobody can. Alright. So let us walk out here and heal. Alright. I I don't think we get a Route 107 encounter yet, because I think I did the Dufert is where we get buried the Chikorita. We did the the route upstairs. The one up here was what was the route again? Route 106. It was uh, Nova the Cedra and Granite Cave, which is I believe is Golem, but um, got killed uh, somehow. So, I think round 107, we haven't got any encounter yet. So, let us check. Do we have enough Pokeball to do this? 7? 7, 2, 2, 1. Um, why not? You know, why not? Right? Why not? Uh, let us... You know what? I'm gonna go at the end right here. And let's have a round 107 encounter. Shall we? Let us all run! Come on! I'm still shocked about the Rayquaza, but hey, can you give me a Rayquaza on Route 107? Route 107 encounter is. Are you? <sighs> Are you kidding me? <sighs> alright, alright. Guess I'll try and catch this. Um Is there anyone that can lower yourself? Yeah, probably blink and rep in. Rep. My god. Why do I get this? I want Rayquaza which is green, not this kind of green. But hey, Metapod it is! I think I should probably start catching it. Alright. Metapod. Nope. Please don't waste my Pokeball. Do not waste my Pokeball, man. I mean, really. Come on, come on. Alright, 
Metapod is caught. Alright. Who is uh, going to be a Butterfree? Metapod the cocoon Pokemon. The shell covering this Pokemon's body is as hard as an iron slab. Metapod does not move very much. It stays still because it is preparing its soft inner for evolution inside the hard shell. Right? Um... Male Butterfree, I guess? Um... What do I name a male Metapod or Butterfree? I, I don't really know what to name it. Because, to be honest, um... I feel... <laughs> I, I, I really don't know what to name this guy, to be honest. But... Hmm... Just gonna call him... Don't ask me why, really. I mean, it's such a horrible nickname also. Not really horrible, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for anyone who has this name. But, um, this is the first thing I think of when I see Metapod and Mitch. And he's a male, so Mitch. The Metapod. Mitch the Metapod. Alright? So, now, oh man, that was really... That was really disappointing of an encounter, if you ask me. Right, so let's check out Mitch the Metapod. I mean, he deserves a show on the screen since we caught him. He's a shed skin, timid nature. I'm not sure what is a uh, timid nature, but I could check it out. Just a uh, real quick like. What is timid nature? Um, of course, he only has Harden. That's all he knows. We don't really have to know the. The moves, because really, Metapod, right, Timid, 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 is increased speed, low attack. Really? We're getting a lot of shit, uh, shit natures, but I guess maybe when become Butterfree, the speed will increase. Yeah, I guess. So, let us put him in the PC. Alright, Mitch the Metapod, you're under backup now. And let us go out. And move along to Slateport. Right. Oh, wait. What did I press? Oh, right, okay. Um, I think before that, let's go Petaburg first. I want to go to the Pokemon. To see, uh, I can top up my potions and the Pokeballs for the next few encounters that we're gonna get. So, just gonna go here real quick. So let's see, um, how many, how many Pokeball do we have? Can I, can, really, like, um, okay, we have four Pokeballs, um, only two potions? Well, we need more. We definitely need more. Need more by now. Ooh, we have Miracle Seed? Let's give it to Barry, shall we? Give it to Barry. Um... Dark Scarf... Uh, for normal type move, I guess we could give to... Um... Uh, Avenger. Because his... Uh, Hitbutt could be useful on that. Um, quick claw. I'm not sure who to give. Like, who is the slowest around? Can we can we check who's the slowest around? Um, let's see. Forty-one, twenty-seven, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-five. Avenger is the slowest. Really? I I really didn't know that. I really didn't know Avenger is the slowest. But hey, I guess it is. Um, by normal type move increase. Yeah, I mean, uh, Avenger has the most normal type move, but I 
Hmm. I think probably I'll give to. Maybe I'll give the Silk Scarf to Manry and then Quick Claw to Avenger. That, that could work. But let us take back the item. And let us give him the Quick Claw. And Manry, you will be given the Scarf. Alright, so let us buy like um, 6 will become 10, 11 will become 15. I'm OTD like that, so I'm sorry. And um, let's see what. Uh, how many potions just now? 2? Um, let's get 8 more. Alright, we got our medication and everything we need. So let us um, walk back to uh, the Pico Dude House and uh, we're gonna get encounter in Slateport and um, let's see if there's any storyline going on over there that we can do or the, probably I think there's gonna be so many trainers in the Slateport area. Alright so we're going all the way to Dufert again. And I think we're supposed to talk to him to sleep for... Okay. Yep, there's Route 107 that we did get encounter which is Metapod. And Route 108 which we get... Nobody yet. We have to go back and get them. And we're in Route 109. Ahoy! We may land in Slateport. I suppose you're going to visit Captain Stern and deliver the Devon goods? This guy know too much. This guy know too much. Alright, so we're gonna get encounter first before anything, before we start fighting with trainers and all, left and right. We're gonna get encounter first. We're gonna put man ray first. And let us o rod again. Please give me a legend or something. Come on. Hey Pokemon's on the hook. Route 109 encounter is Why do I get this kind of... <laughs> Why are all of my Pokemons are so small in scale? Raiden, Kitty, Metapod... <sighs> They're not really big. Bling, who is pretty adorable. Chikorita... Ah, man. Alright, alright. Skiri it is. Skiri it is. So, um... I don't know, if you can leave uh, one bubble, I think it should be fine. Ah, uh, oh, okay, that, that, did, that did pretty much, if you ask me. Now stay in this Pokeball, please. Ah, uh, really? Stay in there. Stay in there. Thank you. Kitty. Alright. A future Del Carry. I never really get to use Del Carry, but I do have the trading card Del Carry and I use did win me a couple of matches. Kitty is known to chase around playfully after its own tail. In the wild, this Pokemon lives in the hole in the trees of forest. It is very popular as a pet because of its adorable looks. Yep, indeed. A female Skiri. So what do I name a female Skiri then? Hmm. Del Carry, who is like a Kitty. Gonna call it a No, I'm not gonna name it Skiri again. Don't worry. Kittles. 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 
I think that's how. Or is it like this? Skittles. Alright, don't need to use the deck. We'll call it Skittles. Alright, so let's check out Skittles, the Skitty. Alright. Skittles, the Skitty, level 7, cute charm, effectuate on contact, quiet nature that totally suits um, Skitty because he looks pretty quiet. But let's check out what is quiet. Quiet is a increased special attack, lower speed. Um, I think I think we could work with that. I mean, as you can see, I think the stats looks pretty all round. He has growl, tackle, tail whip, and a track. I don't know why you still need a track when you are already, you know, on contact. Someone will be in love with you. And um, and I just noticed something. This is our first. Normal type Pokemon. You have grass, ground, psychic, water, and electric. But this is our first normal type. So this is actually a new member to the squad. Alright. We have Skittles, the Skitty, who is going to be in our squad. Alright, I think apparently it seems to be... Um, Lagging a little bit in the Fisher Boy all of a sudden. I apologize for the, uh, the uh, malfunction a little bit. So, alright. So we are uh, coming to the 30 minute mark. I'm gonna try my best to avoid all these trainers first. So that we can see what's going on up there. And, nope, oh, nope, nope. And see whether we can get a slip pod encounter instead. Alright. Welcome to slip pod. Oh, whoa! Team Aquas everywhere. Alright, yeah. Uh, let's let's go and heal first, real quick. Alright, um, okay, so I'm just excited that we get to use Del Carry maybe? I I'm interested more in Del Carry rather than Skiri because Skiri isn't really that kind of a strong Pokemon that we're talking about, you know? Alright, so uh, we're supposed to give to Captain Stern. Is he over here? Is it this guy? Uh, nope. Right. Oh, is this dude, is it? I think it's this dude. Ah, hi, I'm Doc. Captain Stern commissioned me to design a fairy. Oh, that there are the Devon goods. Hmm, this won't do. Captain Stern went off somewhere. He said that he has some work to do. Could I get you to find Captain Stern and deliver that to him? Um, if I know where, I mean, you know, if I know where, and all the Team Aqua just went in. So I think, um,. Yep, there's definitely going to be uh, yeah, the storyline Team Aqua Barrel and all. Alright, so let's have an encounter first of Slateboard. We have 12 Pokeball, which is still fine. So let's use a old rod. Please, we have a Metapod, we have a Skiri. What? You got away. Okay. We have a Metapod and we have a Skitty in our last two fishing. Come on. Please be good to us. A Hitmontop. Alright, um, I guess he's our first fighting type. Uh, I'll take a Hitmontop. I'll, I'll take a Hitmontop. I don't mind. Oh, Hitmontop has Intimidate. I think we know that now. Let us bubble him. Rolling Kick. Right, that's a critical hit. Up, up, rolling king, man. What do you have, rolling cake only? 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down. He just used revenge. Great. Catch this guy real quick. Yes. Hit him on top. Oh shit, I didn't read the Pokedex. I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry about that. Alright. He's a male hip on top. I think I know what I'm gonna name this guy. D1, D only, the king of Spinaroony, Mr. Booker. Alright. I'm just gonna find uh, him on top if I'm able to find a quick one. Did I skip him? Alright, I'm sorry this may be a bit of a annoying part. But I just want to read him on top to you guys. And yep, we even found Rayquaza. Look at this. Can we can we find the area? What? Hey, that's amazing right there. So let us check out Booker T real quick. Oh wait, Booker T is in the PC, right? Alright. Let us run back to the Poke Center. Let's check out our friend Booker T. So I'm not sure. Um we have another typing now that we could use. So we could use either Skittles, the Skitty, which is normal type, or uh, Mr. Booker T, the him on top. Let's check him out. He is a serious nature and also has Intimidate, which we saw that earlier. So what is a serious nature? Can we check that out? The serious nature is actually neutral. Serious nature is neutral. Wow, check out the stats. Now that's the kind of stats that you want them to have. Attack 23, Defense 22, Special Attack 12, Special Defense 26, Speed 19. This is a pretty, pretty bulky, strong Pokemon right here. He has Revenge, Rolling Cake, and Focus Energy. I'm glad he didn't use Focus Energy earlier. <laughs> if he used Focus Energy and Revenge, my main ray would have been killed already. Alright. So I think that's gonna do for today. We managed to give the letter to Steven, have more encounters, we won Brawly to get the Knuckle Badge, and we made it to Slipport with two new encounters as well. In the next episode, we'll probably try and clear off the Team Aqua's um, storyline some more, deliver goods to the Captain Stern, I think, and we're gonna move on with our adventure. If you guys do enjoy the Let's Play so far, do give a thumbs up and subscribe the button down below. I'm enjoying this. I hope you guys are too. And I hope you all have a nice, wonderful, wonderful day.